Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to see, how to create, simple clean audio spectrum, or audio visualizer in After Effects. So without any wait, let's see the preview. Here I have already imported my audio file, and an image for the background. So let's start creating our audio spectrum. Create a new composition. Name it as Spectrum. Set frame rate to 30 frames per second. Depending on your audio file, you need to set your composition time duration. Here I am using 15 second audio file. So I will set my composition time duration to 15 seconds. Here first we will create our spectrum, and at the end, we will create our background. First, let's add music file to the timeline. Now let's pre-compose it. Name it as music. Now let's create our first spectrum. Now create a new solid. Name it as Spectrum 1. Now select the Ellipse tool. Now we need to draw a perfect circle from the center. Press Ctrl plus Shift to create a perfect circle from center. Perfect. Now in Effects and Preset. Search for Audio Spectrum. Add it to the solid spectrum layer. Now let's change the audio layer to our music composition. Now change path to mask one. For a perfect view you can hide the shape path. Now change start frequency to 10. Now change end frequency to 1100. Now change frequency band to 200. Now change maximum height value to 800. Now change audio duration value to 150. Now change thickness value to 2. Now softness value to 0. Now change inside color and outside color to white. Make sure the display option is set to digital. Now change the side option to side B. This will display spectrum outside of mask only. Now you can see the preview. Now in effects and preset, search for rotate over time. Add it to the solid spectrum layer. Now change rotation to 50 degrees per seconds. If you don't want to keep the rotation, then you can set rotation to 0 degrees. Now you can see the preview. Our spectrum is now rotating. Now select Spectrum 1. Now press Ctrl plus D to create a duplicate of Spectrum 1. Now for above Spectrum 1. Change start frequency to 1100. Now change end frequency to 1800. Now change frequency band to 80. Now change maximum height to 2000. Now change thickness to 6. Perfect. Now let's create another solid layer. Name it as Spectrum 2. Now select the ellipse tool. Now we need to draw a perfect circle from the center. Press Ctrl plus Shift to create a perfect circle from center. This spectrum will be smaller as compared to the first spectrum. Perfect. Now in effects and preset, 
Search for audio spectrum. Add it to the solid spectrum layer. Now let's change the audio layer to our music composition. Now change path to mask 1. Now change start frequency to 10. Now change end frequency to 1100. Now change frequency band to 150. Now change maximum height to 50. Now change audio duration to 110. Now softness to zero. Now change inside color and outside color to white. Now change display option to analog lines. Now in effects and preset. Search for a date over time. Add it to the solid spectrum layer. Now change rotation to 50 degrees per second. Now select Spectrum 2. Now press Ctrl plus D to create a duplicate of Spectrum 2. Now for above Spectrum 2. Change start frequency to 2100. Now change end frequency to 3200. Now change frequency band to 200. Now change maximum height to 1400. Now change audio duration to 100. Now change thickness to 2. Now change display option to digital. Now change the side option to side B. Perfect. Now let's create our line spectrum. Create a new solid. Name it as Spectrum Line. Now in Effects and Preset, search for Audio Spectrum. Add it to the Solid Spectrum Line layer. Now first we need to adjust the start and end points. Let's do it. Perfect. Now let's change the audio layer to our music composition. Now change start frequency to 2100. Change end frequency to 3100. Now change frequency band to 150. Now change maximum height to 2000. Now change softness to zero. Now change inside color and outside color to white. Now change display option to analog lines. Perfect. Now in effects and preset. Search for mirror. Add it to spectrum line layer. Now let's position the reflection center. Perfect. Now let's create a new solid. Name it as particle. In effects and preset, search for CC particle world. Add it to the particle solid layer. Let's change longevity to 10. Now in physics, change animation to viscous, change gravity to 0.01. .01. Now in particles, change particle type to faded sphere, change birth size to 0.02, change death size to 0.03, change birth and death color to white. Now in producer, 
change position y to minus 0.35. Change radius x to 0.945. Now in effects and preset, search for glow. Add it to the particle layer. Now you can see the preview. Now in effects and preset, search for turbulent displace. Add it to the particle layer. Now change size to 30. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Now let's add our background image to the timeline. You can scale your image to fit the composition. Or go to transform. Select fit to composition. Perfect. Now let's create a new adjustment layer. Position it below the music composition. Now in effects and preset, search for photo filter. Add it to the adjustment layer. Now for photo filter, change density to 60%. Now in effects and preset, search for brightness and contrast. Add it to the adjustment layer. Change brightness value to minus 50. Now create a new solid. Name it as mask. Now select ellipse tool. Now draw mask as shown. For mask 1, change mode to subtract. Change mask feather to 250 pixels. Change mask opacity value to near about 80%. Now position the mask layer, below the music composition. Now create a new solid. Name it as particle mask. Now draw mask covering the spectrum area, as shown. Now for particles layer, change track matte to alpha inverted matte particle mask. Perfect. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Here our simple clean audio spectrum, or audio visualizer animation is complete. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. If you like this tutorial then make sure to like and share this video and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you.